Good evening. The coronavirus is the biggest threat this country has faced for decades, and this country is not alone. At the height of the pandemic, we saw an incredible response from the people of Southampton and neighbouring areas. Thousands of people came forward to help find an effective vaccine. And that was how the Southampton Research Hub first began. Set up from scratch within the community so that we could quickly vaccinate high volumes of people. We proved it could be done and that people within this area were willing and happy to come forward, take part in research and be vaccinated. And today we've moved here into our specially adapted area of the Royal South Hans Hospital in Southampton. The pandemic may be over, but the COVID vaccine research continues and that's so that we can continue to offer the right level of protection to the public as we move forward. And we couldn't do it without our research volunteers. My name is Lydia and the study I took part in was looking at the effects of the COVID vaccine in young people. It gave me a rather rewarding feeling knowing that I was taking part in something that would be impacting the community, the world and other adolescents. I would take part in another clinical trial again because it's really interesting and I'm interested in the science. Where would we be today if people hadn't have been participating in research trials for the last four, five, six decades. Since the pandemic ended, we've been able to broaden the types of research that we do here in the Hub. We've been involved in running a total of 13 studies with many more to come. We've recruited more than two and a half thousand participants. The number of participant visits to us here in the Hub is running at well over 12,500. And we're so proud to be at the forefront of this many international and innovative research studies. Coming to Southampton Research Hub was an amazing experience. It was a trial that was testing for a vaccine for whooping cough. For part of the study, I spent 19 nights in um, a hotel. Um, I was closely monitored. Every morning we had observations, every afternoon we had observations. Actually being involved in it was so fun um, and ultimately it will be exciting to see what we actually got from the trial. My name's Kerry, this is my son Harry and we took part in the Harmony study last year looking into um, um, bronchiolitis and what that means to children who can get it. The team made sure we were very, very comfortable, made sure we had everything we needed um, and then the aftercare was brilliant as well. For anybody thinking of taking part in research, I'd say do it. It's such a great thing to do. It makes you feel wonderful to be part of something amazing. But there's so much more to come and we really want you to be a part of it. Make sure you sign up online by searching Be Part of Research so that we can let you know of opportunities in the future. Health and care research can only improve and save lives with the help of people like you.